students in this class we are going to see how to convert vulgar fraction whose denominators are numbers ending in 9 okay so to convert such vulgar fraction into recurring decimals we can use in vedic mathematics sutra 1 egadikena purvena this sutra we are going to apply okay so to apply this sutra we know egadikena means one more than the previous so conversion of vulgar fraction into recurring decimals can be done by applying this sutra okay so the denominator should be of this form 1 by a9 the last digit should be end with 9 okay so this a can be anything between 1 and 9 1 2 3 up to 9 okay so if we get any vulgar fraction in this kind then we can apply multiplication method of egadikena sutra okay so in this video, I am going to find the recurring decimal of the vulgar fraction 1 by 19. Okay. So, before uh, we are going to find, check whether the last digit ends with 9. Here, the denominator is 19. So, the last digit is ending with 9. Okay. So, what is the previous of uh, 9? 1. Okay. So, applying sutra, 1 more than 1 is 2. Okay. So, 2 is the multiplier for the conversion. We are going to use 2 as the multiplier for the conversion. Okay. So, in the answer, we have to write the last digit as 1 because in the numerator we are having 1. Okay. So, in step 1, put 1. Okay. So, we know 2 is the multiplier. So, multiply 1 by 2 and put it to the left. Okay. So, 1 into 2 is 2, put it to the left. Okay. In the next step, multiply 2 by 2, 2 by 2 by 2 is 4, 2 into 2 is 4, put it to the left. Okay. And in step 4, 4 multiplied by 2 is 8, put it to the left. So, up to this it is 8, 4, 2, 1. Okay. Now, in step 5, 8 into 2 is 16. Okay. So, 6 put to the left. And 1 is carried over. Okay. So we have to listen here. Here 8 multiplied by 2 gives 16. So put 6 to the left. And 1 is carried over. Okay. In step 6. Multiply 6 by 2. 6 into 2 is 12. Plus 1. Add this carried over. 1. So 12 plus 1 is 13. Again put 3 to the left. And 1 is carried over. So here in this step listen. We are multiplying 6 by 2. So we get 12. 12 plus 1. This carry over is 1. So 12 plus 1 is 30. 3 put to the left and 1 is again carried over. Okay. Now we go to step 7. Okay. So here we have 3. And the carry over is 1. So 3 multiplied by 2. Okay. 3 into 2 is 6. And 6 plus 1 is 7. Okay. So here there is no carry over. So uh we have added, added this carried over 1, 3 times 2 is 6, 6 plus 1 is 7. Okay. In the next step, 7 is multiplied by 2. Okay. So, 7 into 2 is 14. So, 4 to the left and 1 is carried over. Okay. In step 9, 4 into 2 is 8, 8 plus 1 is 9. Okay. And again, multiply 9 by 2, 9 into 2 is 18. So, 8 to the left and 1 is carried over. Okay. In the next step, 8 into 2 is 16. 16 plus 1 is 17. So, 17 to the left and 1 is carried over. In step 12, 7 into 2 is 14. 14 plus 1 is 15. So, 15, 5 is five put to the left and 1 is carried over. Okay. And in step 13, 5, 5 into 2 is 10. 10 plus 1 is 11. So, 11, 1 put to the left and 1 is carried over. Okay. And step 14. 2 into 1 is 2. 2 plus 1 is 3. Okay. So multiply this 1 by 2 and add it with 1. Okay. 1 into 2 is 2. 2 plus 1 is 3. Okay. In step 15. 3 into 2 is 6. No carried over. Nothing. Okay. So 2 into 3 is 6. Again coming to this step. 6 into 2 is 12. Okay. Put 12 to the left and 
1 to the 1 is carried over. And in step 17, 2 into 2 is 4, 4 plus 1 is 5. Okay, in step 18, 5 into 2 is 10. Okay, so then you observe here 0, 1. Okay, again this continues. The same values, the same numbers and orders continues. So, so we stop up to this. So what is the recurring decimal of 1 by 19, this vulgar fraction? It is equal to 0 0.0526 uh, all the values, consider all the values. So 1 by 19 is 0 0.0552, 0 0.055, 0 0.052631, all the values. Okay. So this is the recurring decimal of this vulgar fraction. So to find the vulgar fraction of this form whose denominator ends with the 9, we can use the first sutra, Ega Tikena Purvena, to find the recurring decimal. Thank you.